Hey everybody, uh, let's see, just got some packages in, so I'm going to unbox uh, the Tusk Soft Paneers, uh, Paneer Bags from Rocky Mountain. They were on special for about $139, so uh, I ordered a set and I have a thread posted on ADV Rider. Um, so let's check it out, I'd like to do this in a couple stages, and again, I'm no professional YouTuber, so you know, just an everyday rider. Um, the three stages I would like to unbox, I guess, show you what's in the box, and then the how do I put them on my Tiger 800, and then actually how they work on the bike. So three stages, we'll see if we can get it done, um, since they're kind of new, so I'm just going to kind of cut this open carefully, obviously, alright, and... Yeah, Rocky Mountain uh, kind of had some great pricing on this and with Black Friday specials, so it kind of worked out nicely. Alright, and uh, you know, I hope the lighting's not too bad in the sound. Uh, you know, one of my fellow riders gave me these cool lights to put in. Um, thanks, Matthew. So, a little shout out there. Alright, so you've got some uh, replacement extension straps in the box here. Oh yeah, I ordered a tire pressure gauge. How about that? For a couple bucks. Put that over there. Alright. So it looks like the bags come in one big bag. So there's two in here. So, I guess we'll open this thing up, check them out. Uh, let's see, I also got a tent for some camping for a Colorado trip. Um, a little uh, Nemo Galaxy 2, so we'll unbox that, but that's later. Alright. Let's go back to the knife here. And of course, I went with uh, soft paneer bags, or soft paneers, just because of the fact um, I don't use these a lot um, as far as luggage goes. And a lot of the riding we do is off-road, so I think I would rather have the soft bag rather than the hard bag, you know, for the obvious, in case something happens, um, you know, leg trap, that kind of stuff. All right, so, here we go. This is what they look like. Pretty cool. I'll put this guy down. I don't know if you guys can see that. The inside, not doing a good job here, sorry. The Missendale flyer would be ashamed of me. Um, they look pretty nice from the outside. And again, they have the solid surface to go against the rack right here. Looks like it's Velcroed on. Okay, that's kind of cool. Alright, got a little handle there. There is also a quick release mount um, for the soft bags. I think it's about 120 bucks. If you have a tusk rack, you can install the uh, steel plate on these, and then you know quick release with the little pull spring mechanism on the tusk rack. So that's kind of cool. Um, I have GB or GV racks if you want to call them, and I'm just going to kind of strap it down with straps. So, and that'll be in part two. I'm hoping so. Yeah, these are pretty cool. Nice and hefty. Um, they feel pretty heavy out of the box. Again, hopefully you can see this. Uh, it, I know Chase does a good video um, on installation, so I will definitely watch that video and check it out. But otherwise, I think my big straps are in here. Yeah, these are the thick straps and the little straps in one little bag, so they're pretty cool. Yeah, I think that's it for just opening the box. Um, again, I'm pretty impressed. Oh, bonus, these are the big straps going across your seat. <laughs> Alright, and of course the liners do come with them. They're kind of a high-vis green. I know in some videos they look a little more yellow, but these are the liners that you just put your stuff in. 
the waterproof liners. So that's cool, they come with the set already. So pretty impressed there. I mean, again, for 139 bucks, um, I think these are going to be awesome to take out to Colorado, throw your gear in, um, camp for a couple nights, do the BDR, and then come back. So I'm excited. I'm actually going to look into getting some roll bags for the top to put some, um, like the tent and maybe some holes and that kind of thing. But again, these are pretty solid for 139 bucks. So pretty impressed so far. Um, definitely give you part two. These are the bags that looks like the straps that go across the seat. And then all the smaller little straps. So after I watch the video, then I'll figure out all the strap things. Pretty cool. All right, um, I think that's it for now. Again, just trying to help somebody else. Uh, again, not a professional YouTuber. Nobody really, they just want to help people. Um, and it's always nice to watch something, get a perspective. So there you go. All right. Hey! Did I mention these things are beefy? I mean, for $139?